Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, my name's Christine. If you're new here, please subscribe. And if you're not, welcome back again. Um, today we're just going to do a giant unboxing of a bunch of stuff that I ordered from Amazon and some other places. Um, I will leave you the description of what I bought on Amazon, but I'm not an affiliate of Amazon right now. So when you try to put a link in, it comes out huge and ridiculous. So I will just put the um, description of the product and that I got it on Amazon and the and what I paid for it. And you can do an internet search on, or I mean an Amazon search and find the product pretty easily. Um, I will be setting up my um, Amazon affiliate um, account again. I had taken it off. I had some problems um, with understanding how it all worked. So um, I'm researching it. You know, come on, give me a break. I'm old. And um, I'm not used to all this uh, technical stuff. I mean, I'm pretty good with the computer, but other than that, like video editing, things of that nature, I'm not real good at. I did film you a video on my phone about where I've been for like the last week because I've been doing a lot of planting and um, cleaning up my backyard, getting ready to put my fairy garden in and my outdoor altar and all that. But um, when I tried to upload it, my, my video file was corrupt and I tried to, my grandsons and and um, some others were trying to get it to fix, but it, it just wouldn't. So, lost footage. I'll, I'll get better at this, I promise. So, anyway, I did um, some shopping on Amazon. So I, and I got a ColourPop order. So, I just want to um, share that with you. And then go over some stuff where, like, upcoming um, videos and things of that nature. So, first off... Um, I got these silicone. I already take. I already took them out of the Amazon box, so I didn't have to worry about addresses. Anyway, I got these silicone applicators, and I use these for makeup. They come in a box like this. There, it's uh, twelve pieces silicone butter beauty tools, and twelve of them come in a pack. And this is what they look like. In one of my last videos, I think I told you that my cat chewed the silicone tip off. For whatever reason, the last one that I had. Now, I use these for makeup masks. To, like, apply clay masks and things like that. I'll show you here if I can get it open. Um... You know, to apply like a clay mask. These are silicone. And I also use them in my um, crafting. If you work with hot glue, it, you can just like put the hot glue down in whatever you're gluing and push. And you don't burn your fingers. So, six of these will go in my beauty room and six of them will go in my craft room. So there is that. Also, I got a box of, I don't have the um, prices right offhand, but I usually try to be pretty frugal. I don't spend a lot on everything. These are emergency votive candles. They're 15 hour burn time. And I can't remember how many is in the box. One, two, three, four, five, six, twelve. There's eighteen. I'm gonna go with at least thirty-six candles. And they're all white. They're considered emergency candles. They have a fifteen hour burn time. Now these were on sale at the time. They were on one of those I'm I'm a prime mm -hmm. member. So, it was on one of those flash sales, so I got it. And, um, I'm not a big prepper, but 
anytime that something like this goes on sale, I, um, I will get it just in case. Lately, we've had a lot of storms and um, electricity going out, internet going out. So it's always better to be prepared. And I have many candle holders that are, you know, not fireproof, but more fire safe to burn candles when the electric goes out. So I think that's important. Well, where'd the other thing go? Okay. And on that note, I picked up these emergency blankets. They're army rated. Um, it's a four pack. And um, they're like, as you can see on the picture, I'm not going to open them up. But you wrap yourself around, or, or, or you wrap yourself up in them, and they retain body heat. And I got this because, like I said, our electric's been going out. And I live in Pennsylvania where, you know, just this week, you could get a sunburn and frostbite all in one week. And with the weird storms we've been having and the power going out, this is always just something safe, you know, for safety reasons to have so that you don't freeze to death. I mean, we do have a wood burner. Um, and we do have gas heaters down in the basement you know, to just use radiant heat or whatever, but just to be safe, we got this. Okay. So, for the beauty room, I got these organic cotton rounds. Um, they're from Soul Station, organic cotton rounds, 100 count, pack of four, so there's 400 of them in here, and I think I paid eight or nine dollars maybe ten dollars for these i use them for toner um and i may you know to remove my eye makeup with the eye makeup remover so they come in handy and i like buying everything in bulk all right so this was from amazon as well it's a new oracle card set the sacred forest uh, it says 52 cards to open energy portals of a higher dimension. Um, when you order these, it comes with links to free meditation videos. So I thought that was kind of cool. And I bought this little holder for the cards because I started working with these. So um, I give them their own little holder and put some sage in there in that. So it comes with a little book explaining each card and this is what they look like so um i'm thinking of doing pick a card readings if i can figure out how to get my camera set up um appropriately and this will be one of the cards i also bought a pendulum just to try out, I have another pendulum, but I am born in March, and this is a resin pendulum with aquamarine in it and little copper wire. I really like it. It's it's very responsive. It responds really nice. Comes on this little copper chain. Um, I, this is one of bags I buy for my business um little velvet pouch but I keep it in and I keep it in my curiosity cabinet along with all my um reading cards I do do readings um if you're interested in pick a card reading I might start out with some pick a card readings um let me know in the comments down below and coming up uh, I'll be filming later on today um, a video on Beltane, what it is, um, what I do, what others do, what you can do for Beltane. Also, I'll be filming the Full Moon in May video, which is also an eclipse, which is exciting. Um, I might, if you're interested, and leave it in the comments below, uh, I want to do a video on divination, explaining what it is. Um, also some of the next products I'm about to unbox, 
I'll be doing a few videos on how to make plantain weed salve and dead nettle salve and uh, how to do it and what they're used for. Um, I also want to do some giveaways as I gain s subs. So we'll get to that towards the end of the um, video. Also, I do... I. I was an instructor on an online metaphysical school for a long time and I do teach classes and I was wondering if you guys would be interested in like uh, if I put it in a little category you know certain classes like I have I can grab the list and tell you what I got and you leave in the comments down below or on the next video I'll just I'll list it in one of the upcoming videos of what you're interested in. Um, I don't mind filming those videos and, uh, and whatever. So there's that. Okay, so my next box is, I bought some supplies for upcoming, um, videos and to make salves and for spring. You know, I, I get a lot of, uh, My dried herbs for my soaps and that. This is mugwort. And um, I do make a salve out of this. I don't know why that keeps doing that. A salve out of this. Um, I also burn it. Um, use it in spells. I will list it below and what the price was. I got some crystals. Or some upcom upcoming... Um, Soaps that I'm doing. This is Adventuring and Amethyst. If you buy these in bulk on Amazon, they're pretty reasonably priced. I usually get all my herbs if I buy them, if I haven't grown them and dried them out myself, which are growing season. You know, I just did the seed seedlings. And they're not sprouted yet. We did them. We had like two 80 degree days when I was planting and cleaning up the yard. And then it went from that to 40 degree days and freezing at night. So we had to drag all the plants in the house. Drag them all back out during the day. It's just been a real pain in the ass this bipolar weather. So um, my chamomile, mugwort, and things like that won't be ready till... June is July sometimes, but I'll dry them out and then when I make my fall salves, those will be my, you know, um, stuff I grew myself. This is lavender. This is by Yammies. It is, uh, two ounces of lavender. That's what two ounces of lavender looks like. That's how thick the package is. Um, this is organic. Um, I use these in soaps and I also use these in, uh, use it in salves. These are lavender flowers. And then this is chamomile, also two ounces of chamomile flowers. I also use in salves and soaps. This is a great protection herb as well. Very healing. Lavender you can use in protection, um, jars and stuff, which I'm planning on making a video on how to make protection jars. Sorry for all the bag noises. I also got a three-pack of juniper, which I can't find. I set it down somewhere when I was walking around earlier and can't find it. So, ColourPop order. Everybody knows that I love Jeffree Star's uh, makeup and products. And that's probably why I don't get a lot of subscribers on my channel because a lot of people don't like him and I get it but I like his products and I paid good money for him and I'm going to use them and I feel that he's changing um, he hasn't been in drama a lot lately that's just my opinion it is what it is but anyway I ordered some color pop I was going to get that honey uh, the Pooh Bear one but I'm gonna wait 
So this little card from ColourPop. There's no one better than you. <laughs> now I bought this on sale. I did a sale. And of course they didn't put the whole price in. These were discounted. I believe I paid $10.49 or $8.49 for each palette. So I got the Blue Moon. And I will open it up. Just... I'm sure you guys have seen these, but open up. That's the outer packaging. And this is what it looks like. I'm surprised my cat isn't grooming. Okay, and that is what the palette looks like. It's cute. I'll be doing some spring looks. With these. I'm trying to get out of the habit of keeping all these boxes. But it's really hard guys. Alright. So the second one I got. Is Lilac You A Lot. And of course this is a purple palette. This is what the outside looks like. Oh, that's pretty. Very pretty. Looks like somebody touched that one. Which, that's kind of creepy, but whatever. I'll alcohol it. <laughs> and... Limelight. I just cut all my nails off. When doing gardening, it's too hard to... They were getting cracked. I don't know why my eyes watering so bad. Sorry, we're already up to 17 minutes. Oh, that's pretty. Look at that. I'm not going to do swatches. I'll do swatches when, if you want me to. Just let me know. And I got a Level Up Lengthening Mascara. Um, I love Jeffree Star's fuckproof mascara, but mine's getting, it's at its last leg. I got to order some more. I wasn't able to afford his skincare, but I'm kind of okay with that because I have a pretty good skincare regimen. I'm 56 years old. I don't think I look that bad. Um, I mean, I have wrinkles and laugh lines and smokers lines because I was a Oh, I still am a smoker. Down to three cigarettes a day. Um, it's been hard. I'm not going to lie. And I've been trying to increase, you know, just being more healthy. So this is what it looks like. It's called Level Up. Let's see what the wand looks like. I don't remember what I paid for this. But I'll leave the link below. It's a nice wand. I don't know what I'm smelling. Oh, it's the lilac <laughs> that I unboxed. I couldn't figure out. I thought it was the mascara at first, but it's the lilac. So anyway, guys, what my plans are with this channel is you guys get me to 100 subscribers. We're going to do a giveaway, which will include one handmade soap and one bath tea. When you guys get me to 500 subscribers, I'll do a giveaway with one bar of soap, one crystal, and a candle. You get me to 1,000 subs, which is my main goal, just so I can have that little community tab. Because I think that'll I'll be able to boost my channel a little bit more since it's such a variety channel. It's makeup mixed with other things. And I think that's what screws me up on the algorithm, getting my out there but anyway thousand subs i'll do a ritual bath kit um which will come with um a bar of soap a bath tea a crystal a candle and a spell or a prayer depending on what your um what what you know you do after i'm monetized i want to do two monthly giveaways 
and I'm thinking about doing uh, ritual bath kits, makeup things, homemade salves, things of that nature. Um, I'm going to a crystal show later on and I can use my um, business license to pick up crystals. So maybe some of the boxes will have crystals in them. Um, I mean, you put down below what you're interested in. And if I have it to give away, I will do it. Um, I think what I'm going to start doing is um, when I order makeup, a makeup palette, order two of the same. And um, that way I can do some giveaways. I want to boost my channel. I want this to become part of my business. I don't really sell soap like off of a website or anything like that. All my soap sales are business to business at the, at this time. And the reason for that is, is during the pandemic, when the pandemic first started, um, when we went on lockdown, I live in Pennsylvania, so our governor had put out to beware of handmade items. You know, don't buy handmade items because you don't know. They, you know, everybody was panicking. They didn't know how the virus spread. And, um, you know, don't buy handmade um, hand soap or whatever, which really put, I mean, it crushed, crushed my soap business because I, I went from having a pretty good customer base to thousands of messages, you know, do you use gloves? Are you using a mask? Do you use hairnet? Da, 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 which... Yeah, well, I'm, when I make cold process or melt and pour soaps, I use gloves, goggles. Um, I wasn't doing a mask unless I'm working, unless it's cold process and goggles and glasses with cold process and, of course, a hairnet. And I do have an apron that I wear. But I always wear gloves, and I always wear gloves when I'm cutting my soap, creating my soaps, you know, so... Um, people just quit buying. They, they were afraid, you know. I mean, all the stuff on the news. I mean, it was scary times. But I had some businesses reach out to me <coughs> that were trying to stay open. You know, mom and pop businesses that were trying to stay open during the pandemic. And um, were willing to buy, buy my soaps. So I worked out an agreement. I mean, I don't make a lot of profit on them, but I do make a profit. And then I gave them their suggested retail price. So they also make a profit. And um, I mean, things have been rough. So I'd like to have this YouTube channel as part of my business and make a little bit of money. I'm not going to lie, but I don't want it just to be that. I want to put out quality videos and make friends and build a community and, um, I mean, I'm also always, all, bleh. I'm already a part of a community with um, makeup for Jessica Vargas, and if um, her link's always in my description. Um, if you want to check her out and subscribe to her, she does some awesome makeup looks. She's a mom of nine, I believe, and um, just a beautiful girl all the way around. So please subscribe to her channel. Especially if you're into the makeup and the real neat looks. She does an awesome job. So with that said, that's where this is going. I hope you enjoyed the unboxing. And I will be making some more videos coming up real soon. Especially the next one will be on Beltane. What it is. How to um, celebrate. And, and whatever. So please like and subscribe if you find this content interesting. Um... And I will see you on the next one. Bye.